You say you got me, but I don't say you're the lie when I look in your eyes. Stop acting funny. Shall you know they pick my call? I can call you ten times. Yeah, I love you, even when I don't say you're the lie. No, oh, yeah, I miss you, even when I don't say you're the wrong. Oh, oh, she not because of Jennifer. Now she the do the daddy dad. <laughs> Welcome back, guys. Welcome back to sale with me, Shirley Mimi. Where you get the gist? I said they do it. I said they hurt. Of course, you know there's no sleeping on the bicycle on this channel. If you snooze, you do what? You lose. Or to my darling MVPs, how is your Sunday going? Hope you are having a Mimi Shirley Sunday. To my intended subscribers, hope you have done the needful. If not, kindly please post right now, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. If not, how would you get the gist? I said they hurt. So, guys, hmm. You see that song I sang earlier on? It is between Juicy J and Yvonne because the social space is going agog because of these two. Courtesy of <laughs> Yvonne's message for Juicy J. Now we have the friend badge of this video, yeah? So all you have to do is just sit down and make sure you watch this video till the end because I would be needing your own um, two cents about this gist, okay? I would need to hear from you guys, okay? So I would love you, you watch to the end and just listen attentively because this particular video is in badges. We have the shippers badges who, who are heartbroken. We have those who are modding. We have those who have a say. Everyone have a say about this, okay? And I actually have each of the say in this particular video so you would tell me the one you accept and the one that is wrong and also you would tell me what is wrong about what yvonne did okay so let's start from somewhere because it is actually just too much so guys we all know what today is that today is actually what juicy day yeah and we also know that if um juicy day and yvonne actually did have a thing in the house like called shipping so outside of the house we also how things was going we all listening to the radio interview, the media runs. Of course, I discussed everything with you guys here. And we all know how shippers take this shipping thing so serious. Okay. So, prior before the birthday. Okay, let me say, when the birthday was going on today, no, um, Yvonne has not posted UCJ. And many people were, you know, lamenting, giving sub, you know, indirectly sub to Yvonne. Saying they said it, that she's not going to post him. She's not going to post him and all that. So, as time goes on, Yvonne finally did post UCJ. Okay, please, I want you guys to listen attentively, I beg, so that we would know what we are saying, okay? I would love you guys not to be biased, to just, just say your own two cents. If you're a Yvonne star, please don't be biased and say what you have in mind, because actually, this video, they are modding Yvonne left, right, and center. If you're a Juicy J stan, kindly tell us your mind, please. And if you're a shipper, kindly be sincere, be a sincere person, okay, right now. If you cannot be sincere, kindly do not comment at all, I beg. So, guys, then... They are now, Yvonne now actually finally um, wished Juicy a happy birthday. Now, people are having problem with that wish, okay? We are going to see what she said to Juicy. We are going to see how everything is going on, okay? And we are going to be discussing it bit by bit. If I get to read about a thing, we'll discuss it bit by bit because this video is actually a large one, okay? We're starting from here, right? This was where she actually did wish him a happy birthday. As she said, happy birthday, Happy birthday, amazing Sia. Wishing you a year filled with happiness and endless possibilities. Okay, this was her wish. Is there something actually wrong with this? Okay, some persons are saying that, oh, that she did not even use his picture. You know, some persons are saying, oh, this is so dry. Some persons are saying they did not force you to wish him. Okay, so I would like to hear from you. Is there any problem as we move forward to see some of the things? Okay, I would have like, like to hear from you if there is any problem with this, you know, post. Okay, maybe when you get to follow this video and watch till the end you'll get to see some reason with some persons you never can tell okay now this was juicy j's reply to her juicy j said thanks yvonne i really appreciate it and some persons are saying oh this was dry this was this oh you know and she passed they are actually heartbroken and now i'm trying to think is there something wrong okay this one in particular is yvonne's comment on that juicy j's post on instagram as she said happy birthday see ya you are one of the most amazing and kindest person i know you radiate such you radiate so much energy and positivity i pray god bless you grant your heart Grant your grant you utmost desire. Now, this was Yvonne's comment on Juicy J's um 
Instagram. So now people are they are dragging Yvonne left, right, and center, guys. Guys, uh, if you are Yvonne star this moment, I, I actually feel for you guys because your faith, because I know how you guys feel when your faith is being attacked left, right, and center. Now we'll enter the social streets while we read this bit by bit. Then you get to say your own two cents because it is giving there is an unending issue to resolve right now. Okay, Lerato, this is actually a hater. Like, I'm sorry to say, but she's actually a hater. So sorry to say because I actually posted some of her, her previous screenshots and it's not cool at all she said even gosui you are cruel that live a fake lifestyle miscontent creator what jenny o wrote on her ig story about people like you is true stop using too much filter this is the real you <clears throat> you should be grateful for makeup and weaves without them you are nothing i am actually you know not mentioning some words at least as i am reading it you're watching so if i ignore those words not that i ignore them for a reason they are so they are so deep that i cannot just say it out now what it is giving now the shippers are heartbroken now my question is is there any reason to be heartbroken for this you know when yvonne did her media round in a bomb that she said she genuinely likes someone i told you guys this scene is just like issues like this comes up because you people put your hope so high on this housemate she said like they are growing up it, it is not love yet i don't know if you people don't get it okay lerato said who celebrated their birthday and you posted them you and Juicy should treat each other as stranger and unfollow each other. You are you are as hell. I remember in the house how you used to mistreat him or not wanting to talk to him for no good reason. Toxic Clover replied, God will for pretending to be a co siren in order to throw Yvonne. The girl is not even problematic. That is why I'm saying that you see the reason why I keep saying, you know, you will call her a co siren now because she had a picture of Kosi. And if you are a fan, or you're not a fan of a person and you're using the person picture to know to spoil that person's name that means you are actually really really evil yes you just take a picture of Kosi on your dp and you're trying to use it to to slush him and say things about housemate so that they will call that housemate name it is not a good thing at all okay it's the same letter so this is from the same person you deserve someone as toxic as you who will mistreat you and cheat on you juicy wasted his energy by conversing for you while you were still inside their house people must vote for you not knowing you are a cruel <clears throat> gold digger juicy is a he was supposed to date jenny oh not you you did not even wish him happy birthday even jenny oh posted him on her ig you don't need to be in the relationship to post him he was a housemate just like the rest of the previous housemates who celebrated their own now guys there's something i don't know if some people are actually a bit wise to understand that if you see what is happening between the shippers for example kanaga jr and mutati wendy madiba and Yvonne and Juicy J, you would know that these two people are actually very cool with each other, but they are not being in the public eyes because of the notion the public have for them. You understand? They might address everybody in public, talk to everybody in public because of they actually do, do have a thing. They would want to keep it secret. I don't know if I'm making sense. Okay, Mercenary said, okay, Mercenary VKR said, co Sirens and Yvonne Ami, please let us join hands to report this account because he or she is bringing drugs to co -C, especially coming for Yvonne. No way. Why are you using Kosi speaks to... F now, it is obvious that the Kosi Reigns do not even have issues with Yvonne. And it is very okay if that person is also a Kosi Reign because, you know, I told you guys, among the hundred persons, there must be a Judas. Everybody cannot be okay. Okay, you might... Kosi Reigns are like group of people with different opinion and different notions. So it is okay if that one is not cool with Yvonne. But coming to slander her like that is the worst thing to ever do. Okay, Comrade Attitude said, Can I tweet what I wanted to say now? Help me check if the street is clear i don't want anyone to drag comrade for saying the truth is this still private or the ship has sunk dj play me i am unavailable hmm guys everywhere is so hot right now like if you go to the social space like what i have on my video right now is even less than what is on the social space like they are saying they are they have used different notion on Yvonne. don't worry you'll get to see them in this video some persons are actually happy that this is happening for reasons best known to them i do not know some persons are crying guys it is not funny on the social space the ship done some assaults she couldn't even post him there was no ship those two just chop ship as money clean mouth private i beg now this comment is coming on that the comrade attitude who were asking that is he allowed to say what is in his mind because actually comrade attitude actually said something about this 
some days ago let me not see like a week ago we actually posted it here you know i'm always posting it as the host i actually posted it and said see what he is saying about the shippers that there is no longer sheep among the housemates they are just friendship and friendship is also cool guys it is cool i don't know if i'm the only one seeing it in a different light when i tend to say this that like, some people come to the comment section and said i do not want their faith to ship with certain person who ship pep i beg you should be praying for your faith to excel individually not even about shipping okay it's her song called, thank God my boy can now be free from that old cargo. Really? Really? People in the comments, in, speak in English, talk, us, talk to us direct. You know some people are actually speaking South African, which some Nigerians do not understand. Full name and orange heart, how? So, now, this, full, this orange heart people are commenting on it it's because of the heart um, Juicy J used for Yvonne. It is even now that I get to realize, so, oh, there is a different meaning to that orange heart. And there's a different meaning to, meaning to the red heart. Like, my head has been turning on its own. Like, I'm trying to reason something. That is why I am sharing with you guys. So, we will have to talk in the comment section to see how this is going. Do you think Yvonne actually did you see wrong? Because if you see through their comments, I do not see any problem with them. Like, I do not see these two are actually okay. If they are not okay, Yvonne will not even, even comment or post about him at all. Any girl you're dating and she don't want the world to know that you are dating her. Ask questions. Arrest my case. Game over. Shall, shall, why not the red heart, law? Now, guys, talking about the red heart, the gold heart, the yellow heart. Is there a different meaning to that? Because I personally, I even prefer that orange heart. And I use it. I use it because when I use the orange heart on you, if you comment, if you watch some of my comment section, if I want to reply to some person, if I use the orange heart, that what I actually mean is love. Okay, I mean, I think all those love signs, I just take them as love. Now, I'm, I'm trying to see that people are, are, are reading meaning to the different colors. Okay, every relationship passes through rocks. So, it could be their rocky times. There could be room for adjustment. If both are ready to work on it, can you all rest and leave them to be themselves? Okay, it is how people are subtly rejoicing here. Yeah, some persons are rejoicing. They should have their reasons. Some persons are actually shippers whom they are shipping. The people they are shipping is not working. <laughs> so they are happy that their shipping is not the only ship that is entering, that is hitting rock bottom. Do you understand? There are some persons here who are happy to see this housemate in tears. That is one thing you should know. And those people have a bitter heart. Hmm, I guess it is orange heart onward. Now, my question is, guys, can you people tell me the difference between the orange heart and the um, red heart? Is there any difference in particular? Because I would like to know, because I prefer the orange heart and I use it a lot. So that I will stop using it before people will start reading me. Is the orange heart bad? I would like to know because, hey, these people, they open my eyes for this social space. Because the kind of drag Yvonne is receiving, guys. The kind of drag Yvonne is receiving because of that she posted Juicy J. And people are saying she did not actually use his picture. That is where the problem is coming from, guys. She did not use his picture. Okay, Javon dead. Oh my God, you know Nigerian girls like to build brand with sugar dad. No time for Ben 10. Sorry. Hmm, what a notion. Hi, Bo. Juicy J, can you please stand up? Shoo. Can you imagine what the first person said? Ja Jacqueline, what a notion is that? Like, what, what kind of notion? What kind of narrative is that one? Now, this is coming from Hills. Of course, Hills is, a, is an Yvonne stand. He, he said, the kind of birthday message they expected from Yvonne so they can use it to mod her. Now, it is giving Yvonne wouldn't have even wished Juicy J at all. Because if wishing him could cause all of this, then imagine what not wishing him at all would have caused. Like, really... People will always judge. You won't have to write what exactly. All of you rest, Haba. It is getting boring now. No, they won't have to write a love story about how Juicy J, how I have loved you, how you have done this, how you have done that, okay? I want to know from you guys, okay? What do you think about this? Do you think Yvonne's message was dry? Do you think it is not supposed to be so? You all should free my girl. If you want love, go and look for a man. Vaughn is come back to base. Now, my question is, do you think Yvonne's message was actually dry like many people's narrative? Do you think for a... For the kind of friendship they have, Yvonne should have done more. But do you know what me I'm thinking? Let me read this first. I will tell you what I am thinking. La Noble said, My golden girl will always do her. She can't please others and displease herself. Be cocoa. Now, what I'm trying to say is, I don't know. You Somebody should please let me know that you get what I'm trying to explain in the comment section. You know when you are in good terms with someone, very close with someone, and you have seen that all eyes are in that thing that you have with that person, yeah? You would want to do what you would want to, you know, Hold that, hold that thing back from the eyes of the public because you know that it could endanger you. That is what I think Kanaga Jr., Tati, Yvonne, and Juicy J are doing. 
I don't know if somebody is trying to get me. This is your birthday wish is no giga beg. You copied this from a success card. This was all said to Yvonne under her tweet where she wished you CJ happy birthday. Somebody said she copied it from a success card. Like she went to <laughs> she went to look from a success card to wish you CJ happy birthday. Like really. Little Bastrata said, Ncho, but where is the drama, Von Von? Ask more, I love you there. See this one. Did anyone force you to wish him a happy birthday? Now, Truth Icon is dragging you, so the guy has been nothing but kind to you. Rest. It is how you people are making it seem like Yvonne did something wrong for me. I am still trying to place it. You know when I keep saying things that the people will say, oh, you know they've given me different name. They say I, I am a co-sister. Next means I am a Yvonne star. Next means I am Tabang. Next means I am Tati. Some say you hate Tati. Some you hate Kosi. Like it's just been going around. But it will not stop me from saying the truth. What do you guys expect from Yvonne? That is what I would like to know. Let me know in the comment section because that is why I'm bringing this to your doorstep to talk to me. Let me understand. Maybe there's a part of me I'm not understanding. But I hope you guys understand where I'm coming from between Kanasti and the Javon ship. We enjoy every moment of it. This is the, you see, these Javon shippers, they are the best shippers so far. They are the best shippers. I keep hailing this Javon shipper because you know why? This Javon HQ is the high, is the, how would I put it, the head of the Javon ship. You understand? Why I told you that I love this shippers so far is because they are not toxic at all. They accept whatever Yvonne and Juicy chose in as much as they want to see them together. They accept it. The Javon shippers are the best shippers so far. Yes, I said it with my foot chest. Okay, now they're asking her HQ, what do you mean? Because she said they actually enjoyed the moment they see. And she replied, I'll be he. My own is if you call yourself a Javon shippers, you dare not disrespect either of them. Now you see the way it is going for them. Even some other shippers, they will start attacking, attacking one person. They will start attacking one person. But the Javon shippers are not like that. They are not toxic. That is why till tomorrow, instead of any ship, if tomorrow Mimi Shosti Mimi wants to join a ship, eh? Because which I know it will never happen. <laughs> if I want to join a ship, I would, I would, I would think about the Javon shipper. You know why? They are not toxic. They are toxic free. Like they, 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 they understand Juicy J. They celebrate them individually. Juicy J and Devon, they celebrate them individually. Hmm. Game done caught. Now today on I know it is the what I keep saying is you guys place your hope so high. That is why this thing is happening. Juicy J and Yvonne, we are the one ship that was supposed to carry us all. What is this now? Anyways, for me, the one ship that I had in mind that, that is serious in the house was the Canasty ship. Let me be sincere. Yes, I was thinking it is going to excel outside of the house. Now, I want you all, honey, to free my Yvonne and move on, please. It was fun while it lasted. That This is the best way to reason. Not trying to, you know... To try hitting hammer on the head and start lamenting on one person's name. This person is this, this person is that. But rather, it is just others that is doing that to Yvonne. Okay, because Yvonne is the only person they are lambasting right now. Kezia, Kezia said, Yvonne didn't like Juicy that much to date him outside. She is huge BBM fan who went on the show so she knows how shipping works. And since she isn't controversial person, she needed to hop on a ship as her storyline. Guys, do you accept this notion? Let me know in the comment section. All I need from you now is to, to give your two cents, your sincere two cents in the comment section, please, that is void of bias. We don't need anybody that is biased in the comment section. If you're biased, kindly keep your comment to the next bloggers, okay? I want sincere people. Do you think Yvonne is actually wrong? Do you think there is any problem? Do you think there is supposed to be even problem at all? Let me know in the comment section because I have said mine. I, I feel... There is nothing wrong with this. Yvonne and Juicy are friends. But some people have their hope are high. In as much as Yvonne used the word I like. She genuinely liked him. This thing can grow up from like to love. Do you understand? This thing, they just met in the house. They are outside of the house now and it's a different ball game altogether. I think the best thing is to let this house make grow. So guys, what do you think about all of this in the comment section? Do you think Yvonne is as bad as they label her. Do you think she actually did bad to Juicy? Do you think, just let me know whatever you feel in the comment section. I'll be right there with you guys to see what your notion is. And please, kindly be civil with your comments, okay? Thank you so much for watching, guys. I love you guys so much. Right now, I am signing off with my foot chest to see you guys later. Bye-bye.